You're wearing a cross? Yes. What does that mean to you? Um, it represents everything that God has done for us and will do for me in this life and the next. So if I said to you, Courtney, I'm dying, I've got a knife in my back, I've got three minutes to live, I'm scared of going to hell, what should I do to enter heaven? What would you tell me? I would tell you to confess your sins, ask for forgiveness. Who to? To Jesus Christ. Repent and to ask for forgiveness and ask for a better place after this life. You and I broke God's law, the Ten Commandments. Jesus paid the fine. That's what happened on that cross. That's why he said it is finished. Just before he died, he was saying paid in full and then rose from the dead and defeated death. And if you'll simply repent of your sins and trust in Jesus, not your goodness, but trust in Jesus, God promises he'll grant you everlasting life as a free gift not because you're good, but because he's good and kind and rich in mercy. Is this making sense? Yes.